YouTube. You probably can't see me, and I don't really care because I'm driving right now. Hello. And uh, today I wanted to shoot a video about a rant. We'll call it the traffic rant. How about that? It'll be our new segment here on Go Team Whipple, and it will be random topics that I can rant about while I'm driving home. Uh, notice how I am not holding the camera. My eyes are on the road because I am a safe driver. Thank you. Anyway, the rant for today is customer service and the lack thereof in our society today. What is it that is so difficult about customer service? A simple hello, how are you? Welcome to X store that I work for. Why is that so hard, people? I don't understand. Like, it's a lost art, apparently, in today. In today? That made sense. I use human words. Um, I just went to CVS to pick up a prescription. Because I needed a prescription. And the woman, I went up to, like, one of those, hi, that's my hand. Hello. I went to the drive through window at CVS. Because I use the CVS, it's right by my work. And that just makes life easier. So anyway, pull up to the drive through window. There's two cars in front of me. Two cars in front of me. I'm number three. And so I wait a couple minutes for the other cars to go about their business. And then I can pull up to the window. And the lady in the window literally is standing there, picks up the phone, does not say a single word. Not one. She just looks at me. And I'm like, hello? She's like, hi, welcome to CVS. I was like, thanks. I'm here to pick up a prescription. Can you help me out with that? She's like, yeah, what's your name? Blah, blah, blah. I'm like, okay, fine. Here's my particulars. Please go get my prescription. She's like, okay. Puts the phone down, walks away. Like they do to go get the prescription. And then she comes back. And she prints out her little thing. Doesn't say a word to me. Because, you know, I'm not a human being. You don't need to talk to me or acknowledge my presence. <laughs> she just sits or picks the phone back up, prints out her little receipt that I have to sign, hands it to me to sign through the little dooly wobber. I don't know what that's called. And she's like, okay, I need you to sign this, please. I'm like, okay, cool, thanks. So I sign it, give it back to her. She's like, okay, thanks. Have a great day. Or no, she didn't even say have a great day. She just said thanks. Yeah, okay. You said the nice words. Thank you. Welcome to CBS. But other than that, you didn't interact with me. You did not treat me like a human being. Like, would it trouble you that much to say hello? How can I help you? Is it really that hard? Like, is it? I don't think it is, kids. I don't. And this woman, I don't know how old she is. She's probably like my age, maybe slightly older. I don't freaking know. But really, you can't even say hello to me. Like, at all. And just treat me like human. Oh, there's two policias in front of me. I see them with my hawk eyes. Um, so yeah, that was my rant for the day. The lack of customer service that I got from this like prescription person. I don't even know what your title is. Prescription grabber. That should be your title. Because that's all you did. You grabbed my prescription. Congratulations. Um, anyway, somebody's trying to cut me off. So I'm going to go. Let me know in the comments down below. Do you have this situation come up often? Because I do. I don't know what it is, but people who are in like customer service positions are just total assholes to me. And it makes me want to punch them in the face. And I legit like get supervisors involved sometimes because they're just total assholes for no reason. Or they're just like legit stupid and fight with me. I literally have had people fight with me about just bullshit, like just plain bullshit. They don't know what they're talking about. They refuse to do anything about it. <laughs> and they blame me for their incompetence. So anyway, let me know in the comments down below. Have you had that situation before? Granted, not everyone in customer service is like that, but when they are, it just sticks out in my brain and it makes me want to rant. So let me know if you feel the same way. Let me know if you've had fantastic customer service lately. Where have you had fantastic customer service? Have they been really nice to you and above and beyond and just been fantastic overall? 
again, let me know. Um, go ahead and subscribe. Also, if you have not done so already, because subscribing is awesome and you should do it. That's all. Have a great day. Thank you for watching. Bye.